Today, I'm gonna to show you how to do this speed rubbing effect inside of Premiere Pro. Hey there, thanks for checking out Video Editing with Tyler White. I'm Tyler White and I've been a video editor for about eight years, so if you're looking to increase your skills editing video, tap the subscribe button and hit the bell so you don't miss a single video. All right, so once we have Premiere open up, first thing we're gonna do is grab our footage, drag it over into our timeline. Once we have it on our timeline, we're gonna select it, press Command Plus, make this a lot bigger. And what you can see is there's a line here. And what I wanna do is I wanna right click FX, click on time remapping, then go over to speed, click on that. And then the, as you can see, the line came down here. This line represents the speed of the clip. So what I wanna do is I wanna press P on the keyboard, find a spot on my timeline where I want to speed up the footage. So let's just say right about here. I'll select that. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag this up to 500. I shot this clip originally in 120 frames a second. So once I bring it up to 500%, that should bring it to about normal speed. So I'm gonna make this a little bit bigger here. Then I'm gonna go over and I'll stop right about here. I'm gonna press P again on my keyboard. And what I'll do now is I'll press V to bring back up my cursor and I'm going to drag this back down to 100 because the only part that I want to be sped up is that section in the middle. So we'll drag this back down to 100 for normal speed. That's got it. All right. And now, as you can see, there are two keyframes here. So what I want to do is I want to make this a little bit bigger and I want to select this keyframe. And what I want to do in order to make it super smooth, I want to drag this right side over. And as you can see, this brought up this portion here. So I'm gonna press Command Plus a little bit more uh, just to make this a little bit bigger. It brought up this here. And what I'll do is I'll pull this little bracket over, creating that smooth ramp. That way it's not abrupt whenever it comes into the full speed. So it just goes and slides right up like natural. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side here. I'll pull this side over and then I'll click on it. It's gonna bring up this bracket and I'm gonna make it a slow ramp. What we'll do is we'll make this a little bit larger and I'll show you what it looks like. Speed ramping can really help bring your videos to life, whether it's speeding it up or if it's slowing it down. If you'd like to learn more about slow motion video inside of Premiere Pro, I did a video on that. I'll go ahead and link that up in the YouTube cards now if you wanna check that out. All right, that's gonna do it for today's tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you learned something new. And if you have a sec, if you could drop a quick like on the video because every little bit helps. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Also, if you have specific tutorials that you would like to see, feel free to drop them down in the comment section and I'll check those out. Thank you so much again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.